Hi, I'm Marc Verdiel and we are at DesignCon 2023 and I have a real cool demo that I want to show you. This is the original Apollo S-Band communication hardware that was used in the Apollo Moon missions in the 1960s and early 1970s. It operated at 2.1 GHz and was called the Unified S-Band Link, or USB for short, not, not the USB you know now. It consolidated voice, data, ranging, and television signals on three S-Band carriers. So it was able to transmit live TV from lunar distances. It was a space communication tour de force in the mid-1960s, being all solid state except for the power amp. We have most of the spacecraft microwave communication electronics on display. Looking at these items, the equipment on the left was the NASA ground test equipment, used to make a test version of a ground station. It includes the update link, the PM transmitter and PM receiver, the FM receiver, the interface simulator. The equipment on the right was in the command module. We have a drawing that shows where this equipment was located in the spacecraft. That includes the USB -E transponder, the traveling wave amplifier, the pre-modulation processor, the data link, the PCM telemetry, the central timing equipment, and the audio center. The Vidicon TV camera is not the NASA original, but it is a fair representation of the size of the actual one. And all equipment is on loan from private collectors. In the center, we have some non-NASA equipment to help us run and monitor the setup. This includes the 400 Hertz three-phase power source, a spectrum analyzer, a frequency meter, and a period correct TV monitor. We are currently restoring this equipment to its original functional state. You can follow the restoration progress on the CuriousMark channel on YouTube at youtube.com slash CuriousMark. I am Mark Verdiel from Samtech. I design Con 2023. Thanks for watching.